Baia is an ancient Roman city that has been submerged under the sea for over 500 years. The city is now open for exploration and offers a unique experience for diverse and history enthusiasts alike. Baia was a resort town that attracted Rome's nobility in the latter half of the 2nd century BC due to its mineral waters and mild climate. The town was known as the Phlegrian, or Flaming, fields due to the calderas that pockmarked the region. The calderas were revered by the ancient Greeks and Romans as entrances to the underworld, but they also fueled a number of technological advancements, including the local invention of waterproof cement, which spurred construction of airy domes and marbled facades, private fish ponds, and lavish bathhouses. Baia was also known for its sinful reputation, and its abundance of volcanic activity ultimately caused much of the city to sink into a watery grave, where it still sits today. Tourist interest in the once popular coastline was renewed in the 1940s when a pilot shared an aerial photo of an edifice just below the ocean surface. Since then, advances in marine archaeology have offered glimpses into this chapter of antiquity, including submerged rotundas and porticos, such as the famed Temple of Venus, which was not a temple but a thermal sauna. The ruins beneath the sea's surface lie in relatively shallow water, at an average depth of 6 m, allowing visitors to see some of its eerie underwater structures from a glass-bottomed boat or video barca. Local diving centers such as the Centro Sub Campi Fligrio also offer snorkeling and scuba tours of the submerged city a few kilometers out in the Tyrrhenian Sea. On a calm day, visitors can spot Roman columns, ancient roads, and elaborately paved plazas. Many of the submerged sculptures are actually replicas, with the originals located up the hill at Baia Castle, where the Archaeological Superintendency for Campania manages a museum of relics pulled from the sea. Above-ground Roman ruins are also visible nearby at the Parco Archaeologico del Term di Baia, featuring the remains of mosaic terraces and domed bathhouses excavated in the 1950s by Amadeo Maiuri, the archaeologist who also unearthed Pompeii and Herculaneum. The Parco Archaeologico del Term di Baia is a fascinating site to visit, showcasing the opulence and grandeur of ancient Italy. Despite its current state, the area still exudes a sense of leisure and pleasure, making it a popular destination for visitors. However, seismologists predict further volcanic activity in the area, which could jeopardize the site's future. With the possibility of future volcanic activity and the talk of permanently closing the ruins to visitors, time may be running out for those who wish to explore this lost relic of ancient Italy. Nonetheless, visitors can still search for a hidden entrance to the underwater city, where they can marvel at the spectacular subterranean treasures that lie beneath the surface. It is always important to prioritize safety when visiting any historical site, and visitors should heed any warnings or guidance given by local authorities. Nonetheless, for those who are able to explore the Parco Archaeologico del Term di Baia, it promises to be a truly unforgettable experience, offering a glimpse into the lavish lifestyle of ancient Rome.